Hello, YouTube. We're back. Chopping out our remaining settlers. Much and more to do. Getting them actual tiles is good as well. Lots of things to spend our resources on. I do want to unlock printing. I also want to get our university stuff going. So a couple techs. A couple techs on the way. This is Chichen. Do I have a second mark? Do I have a second uh, commercial hub anywhere? This is my first. I can get this one. Maybe I'll try to get this one real quick. But in two turns? Nah, it's not happening in two turns. Let's just hard tech it. Yeah, I know, Nick. That the, the the holy site in Boston is brutal. How do we feel about our policies? Decent. Black, thank you so much for the 16 months. Welcome back with that Prime sub. Thank you so much for sharing your Prime sub with me. Those go a long way in terms of supporting me, and I very much appreciate it. Wow. Campuses? That would have been pretty sweet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, this is... Uh, <laughs> We'll, we'll spread our religion with a couple missionaries. Eventually we'll enhance. I don't need to do so this era. We're not missing out on a whole lot. Probably stupas? Nah, maybe housing. I don't know. Alright, I think it can be time to move Liang. Probably just to our... Um, probably just to Damascus. And we'll try to get our... <laughs> so many crabs. Um... Our mausoleum going. I like that you can just slouch into mausoleum in almost any game. This is a park. Boston can do a natural park, or nas national park or two. I don't know what else though. <laughs> is there a particular time we're still d r running the double envoy policy? Yes. Um, because we will get free envoys um, with the city states flipping. So like all like these two should be ours at any moment. Uh, and then sometimes there's other ones that we can run into along the way as well. Um, but I, I, I prefer that in barb mode. If it weren't barb mode, you'd be correct to run the two influence points. Um, and I could micro it a little bit better. I I, I, I admit that it's probably a little lazy uh, the way that I approach it. Ooh. 
Yeah, it, it again, I, I should probably pay more attention and micromanage it to get the maximum. Because because the idea is the influence the influence card will get you more envoys, but so will this card, right? And if I if I if I were willing to pay closer attention to it on a turn by turn basis, we could do both and really maximize it. It's probably like the results are maybe similar. Musician and trade route. What other envoy quests do we have? Um, engineer, musician, writer. Train a galley is still a thing. Train a horse. So a galley and a horse I think will make sense. A bit of housing, I guess. Actually, let's buy the market and build the Grandmaster's Chapel. I can't buy these. And then we'll get more um, governor promotions. Another trade route for Cairo. I need to get this settler. Maybe that's my next big priority. But I'm never I'm never not buying in the trade route. Rome wants to be friendly. Uh, did, do we have alliance tech? We just got it. So... Let's make some allies. Um, you think you think Mirko wants a cultural alliance? Lol. Um, honestly, I think I'm okay with it. It might mean he settles up in our face, though, which I would rather avoid. So maybe a cultural alliance with Rome? Or even Movemba? Depends where I can send that trade route next turn. Let's look at the available routes. I can go to Movemba, but from here. But I can go to Rome also from those. Hmm. Look at economy numbers. Scary culture. Wow. Turn 114 and we are really behind. Um, all right. Culture it is. You guys don't have any money. <laughs> Remember the plan, I always will. Thank you very much, my friend. Thank you for the 53 months of support. Glad things are going well. Another month done and dusted smiley face. Love it. Thank you so, so much. Appreciate you. Appreciate it a whole lot. I yeah I uh, I haven't done culture. Yeah I, I it's it's very interesting. I haven't done culture with this um with 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 uh, Arabia. I don't think ever. So still chopping a couple things with Magnus. Probably just this last settler, and we'll try to like faith by the rest or something. Want to move Magnus? Oh I was. Should I move Magnus here for mausoleum? Or should we just build it naturally? Magnus probably needs to build Forbidden City. I think I like that more. This could have been an okay... Um, Zimbabwe? Why is he so choppy? Something's been weird. I, I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm having Civ issues or if I'm, st I'm still like just reeling computer issues.
genuinely don't know. Gotta do something with Boston eventually. Hello, Pandoon! It is doom for you, Pandoon. Um. So choppy. Oh, is that? Oh, you didn't mean you. You meant actually choppy, right? Not like punny choppy. I missed it. Ah, ha, 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 ha. I get it. I get it. I get jokes. It was a joke. I get jokes. I'm uh, going to order parts today, probably today and tomorrow uh, for the new PC. We'll do a live build. Um, if you're... Yeah, I, I I don't know I, I don't know when everything will get here, but I'm I'm gonna order parts real quick. We'll do a live build on stream and uh, and then then we'll be reroll specialists because the processor is going to just gobble up this game. Very excited. Still working on um, fundraising. Still working on fundraising. We've got a great baseline PC. If uh, there are a couple other things that I'd like, so we're we're gonna keep fundraising for a little while longer. Um, I mean, I, it's been incredible. The amount of support has been amazing. Um, but I'd, I'd I'd like to hit a little bit more uh, to get like a, a a nice standing desk and some other things. Need some new perifs. So there's our double envoy. Oh, and it's Chinguari. I don't have to clear this yet. We've got a good enough graphics card. We didn't, we didn't, we don't have enough to get like the nicest stuff. Um, hence kind of continuing to fundraise. Um, but I'm fairly happy with what we can afford. can use these chops elsewhere like here so Magnus to Forbidden City thank you Chimera yes indeed continuing to fundraise it's much appreciated it's just it had been so long since I had updated anything. And since I had actually built my PC, that is a salty city. So it's going to feel amazing. Um. St. Basil's. Well, beloved Dub Dub. Pandoom. Hope this will help. It totally does. Everything helps. Thank you so much. The $20 is incredibly generous. Thank you, Pandoom. 
Uh, it absolutely does, and the, the continuing generosity blows me away. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Are you going faith or science this game? I'm actually going to do culture, I think. We have a we have several science games in a row coming up with uh, the Koreas. I don't care as much about this. Um, and so I figure I, I and I'm just trying to do a, a, things that are a little bit different than what I've sort of historically done, uh, and we've just absolutely gone for you can't go um, around science with Arabia. Like every time I played them, so to me it makes sense to try some different choices and just see how some other strategies come together. I usually like to show the ideal um, thing that you can do with a sieve, but. You know, it's year seven of Civ six, so I also want to feel something when we're doing it. Historically playing Civ, your new handle that'd be like Paisley Trees's channel. Love a love a dub dub. Oh, anonymous! Thank you for the twenty dollar dues. Uh, much appreciated. Thank you, dear friend, uh, anonymous person, whomever you are. I, re I respect both your an anonymity and um, and how generous you are, so thank you. So now we can get spicy. Spices will be really great here with our Cheech in play. That's right around the corner, right? Or did we just unlock it? We did just unlock it. Maybe it's my GF. Could be. Could totally be. How how would I ever know? It's anonymous. We can get another. We can get this settler out of where we're putting Magnus now. I do need one more city down here. Um. I want to get the Saint Basil's first though. Chichen's medieval. We do need the other card. We do need the other card. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Anonymous. Do 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 do. Perhaps the perhaps the the anonymous donation is an amalgam of several mythical creatures. I don't know. How would I know? I wouldn't. That's the whole point of being anonymous. Mana, mana, do 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 Why did I do that to you? I'm I, I apologize. I apologize profusely. Hardest you for thing for you with Civ uh, is using other aspects to support your wincom, like how religion can help win a culture game. Yeah, yeah, and those th that mixture is is actually like very powerful in my opinion. So it's good to try new things. Stuck in your head now. I you know I mean I'm sorry. But also, am I? <laughs> Thank you, Chimera. How do you think Reunion Civ is not restarting every 40 turns? That's fair. That's a, that's a challenge as well. I, I respect that. That's a difficult thing. Might be time to start buying great works. It's turn 117. We're well on our way. I 
Where is... trade route super soon. Alhambra goes. So we saw Patala go come down. It's not gone yet. I can actually place this. This is pretty good. With the sun shining bright. Yeah, still no relic from that. I probably shouldn't have been exploring there. It's a bit silly. Didn't need the era score, and finding them is actually kind of bad. I want wonders in the cap. I, I built Apadana, and then no more wonders. Silly. Abe gets Huey. How about that? Ish cities. Again, I probably shouldn't be exploring, but I kind of am. Kind of just am. How often do I find myself raiding barb camps for gold? Not super often, unless I have total control over the camp. They kind of spawn out of, like, they spawn pretty crazily once you start doing that. Um, and so early on is kind of, like, this amount of gold just, like, isn't worth it now, right? To, like, have the frustration. Like, I, if I have to, if I do this and have to buy a unit, it's just kind of bad. Um, so not very often, but sometimes early on, if I have total control over the camp, I can I can justify it. What up, Scotty? How you doing? Uh, Hot Kettle Cafe. Hey, friend. What's the How game of the you? day? Uh, the game today is Arabia. Playing Arabia and uh, having a great time. Doing doing different things. Um, doing cultural things. Arabia is pretty pretty strong. Pretty powerful. And we're just kind of relaxing and having a nice and a nice day as our stream fam. Um, 
But yeah. So good to see you. Thank you so much for the tier two. Welcome back for 68 months. So good to have you here. I appreciate you. And I hope all is well in your life. And with the little ones, the baby kettles. Thank you, friend. If you want to farm the camp for some reason, but it seems a bit exploity. It's just, it, you just don't get to do it that often. Losing a lot of sleep because you're an adult with no self-control when it comes to limiting how late you stay up gaming. I hear you. Boy, I am learning. But this last year has been incredible for me in terms of discovering things about myself, specifically in terms of like mental health and ADHD. And it has been an amazing journey. I'm feeling outstanding these days. And um, self-control. That's a thing that I've struggled with in my life. That's on that ADHD list. As are many, many other things. I really want to get Laventa back. Do I have Laventa? Oh, I have Laventa. Okay, then we just need builders. Hey, look, builders. No, wait. No. Did, was it... Did the game listen to me? That Why? Is a man. I... I just... I was just saying. This is Jow's music. Thank you, Hero. It it feels good. It like that's the biggest thing is it actually feels good to feel better and 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 it's been a long journey. It it has been it's taken a, a considerable amount of effort, but I I, I I as I was saying the other day, it does it does eventually pay off, and uh, I'm very grateful for it. Yeah, Rapa. We had a great Rapa game in the last one. Uh, not in the last one. Who were we playing? That was Rapa. Was amazing. I forget now. I forget now. All right. So I want to go here. I need a second temple. I need to get this city. Magnus is almost here. Jebel. All is well. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. Sleep has always been a struggle for me, Scotty. So I, I relate with this. Seems redundant and obvious, but feeling better is its own separate feeling, uh, and, and that feels amazing. Anytime you've been doing well enough to be proactive on the things you do, you're able to truly relax. I know, it's, it's, it is, yeah. I completely understand that. It almost seems contradictory, but it's not. It, like, makes total sense to me. Uh, knowing that you've handled your stuff well enough to breathe is intensely satisfying. Exactly. Like, the anxiety sort of begets anxiety, and it's, it winds up being um, spirally, you know, or, or can be. Well, Ratho, thank you so much for the 19 months. And it's been weird sharing the journey in public, but I, I'm really grateful for it because I think it's like forced my hand at confronting all of the things versus sort of being able to mask and cope and just kind of get by.
which I think there are a lot of jobs that you can totally just get by and it's fine. You know what? I am just going to clear this. So I want to get rid of Maui. Sharing your journey has prompted you to start your own. So thankful that you are. Thank you, Ken. That And that, that really makes it worth it. You know, that makes sort of the difficulty of it worth it to me. Um, and it makes it all kind of make sense. So I really appreciate hearing that. And good luck on your journey. It's, it is it is a journey and it takes time. And, you know, I, I, I'm learning things about, like, learning like obvious things about myself all the time. Which is humbling, but also really kind of uplifting and, and um, ultimately like a really, really good thing. I don't have the policy to chop these things just yet. But I am pretty much ready to do that. What are we what are we missing out on in this? Not a lot since we got our admiral, one merchant and a writer. Brain, are you worried? Me about what? Brain, I don't know. Oh my god, you're right. Exactly. Exactly. And it's hard it's hard to it's hard to get out of that. I continue to do the EMDR and therapy. Uh, I started to do a bit of that with your own work and just wondering, uh, just at the beginning stages, wonder how other experiences with it. Honestly, um, therapist is probably a lot like a first girlfriend or boyfriend or they friend. Um, in that, uh, sometimes it takes a long time to find the right fit and the right one. Um, and I, my therapist is lovely and has helped a lot. Um, but most of my journey has been in the realization of ADHD stuff. Um, and so I've decided that I don't want to do EMDR with this particular therapist, but it's still on my radar for future, um, future times. So, um, so to answer your question, no, I have not, but not because I'm not willing to do it just cause I want to, I want to do it with someone that feels a little more, um, I don't know. I don't know what the right word is, and I and I don't want I don't want that to I don't know maybe it feels a little weird to to say that, but um, I do just kind of want to do it with someone that feels better. So Like it's a really like personal, intimate thing, and I just really want to feel understood and seen in the process. Not that I don't, I don't know. Maybe I'm too picky. I know where you're coming from. Uh, you've been comfortable with your therapist, and it's really helped. Yeah, I've I've gotten so much out of therapy, but I I I honestly like in terms of really feeling seen and understood. Um, I don't know. I'm just not there yet. And that's okay, right? Yet is the key part of that. Like, it's a, it is a process and a journey and all that stuff. So, um, I should be buying great works sooner rather than later. Uh, let's look at the culture win screen. Two of one hundred eight. We're at one of one twenty three. Um, lots of eurekas to purchase. Lots of things to purchase in general. Uh, J Philly three thirteen. J Philly, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate you. Oh, Magnus is here. We should get on Forbidden. Oh, I'm not. I don't have Forbidden yet. I actually want to finish this campus, and then we'll buy the buildings, and then we'll get working on. We'll buy the Eureka, basically. Keep hitting that button. I also want to flip around our corporations soon.
doing the holy site first over the harbor i don't know why it's probably not as good especially when we have a harbor policy but i know i said i was gonna buy things some strategies as herald um just pillage pillage and war uh i've got a really our last herald game um on my youtube was a lot of fun used the berserker a lot um just did like naval war combo stuff and it was amazing um he's actually a really really good civ now was a little weak for a while but is pretty outstanding in this iteration I want to go maybe actually up to candy so we can extend further trade routes from there. I think I like that. But basically pillage and war with with uh, with Norway. He's one of the best domination civs in the game. Civ 7 win, I know, right? I know, right? don't get it i mean game development takes a long time and like you have to you you have to if you force it we've seen the disasters that is trying to release games too quickly i'd rather have them take their time with it and make an outstanding game than than force something that just is like that they're putting out just for the sake of putting it out um i, I also think that because because the franchise is like really really mature um like we're in the sixth iteration of civ and they they add in new features and stuff like it take it, it's got to take a lot to be like okay what do we like we don't want to completely reinvent the the wheel but we don't just want it to be civ 6.5 um i don't know i'm i'm basically i'm ha i'm happy waiting i i i know that i i know that we're anxious for it and that's like frankly a big compliment um to to the franchise and stuff but Completely happy waiting, personally. Civ 6 set the bar so high. For sure. It just the whole iteration has been amazing to watch. Like, the different... Just to see them be more in touch with the community by the end of it. You know, like, it was kind of... Um, you know, it's been a process. And it's been outstanding to see. Don't mind waiting. Wish it would get here. Absolutely. Yeah, that's and that's absolutely fair. Some new civs I want to see. I want to see a TGM civ. I want to see me as a leader. That's not actually true. I, I, I don't. I like that it's historical. Hiawatha. I miss Hiawatha. Would love a remastered Alpha Centauri. Ooh, that's interesting. A person can be historical if the timeline's close enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. If I was a modded leader, what abilities would I want? Uh, we we did this. We did this experience. We we created me the Civ uh, a long time ago. It hasn't been updated in a while. Uh, but my unique unit is the Build Explorer. <laughs> So builders, I think builders, it was like builders have one extra movement and every time they found a goody hut, they get, they got an extra, uh, charge. <laughs> um, what else was me? I don't remember. I, something about probably like can't build industrial zones. Um, <laughs> but other things are good. I don't know. It's, it's been a while. It's been a while since I've thought about it. If I'm perfectly honest. I could try to pull it up in between videos. And we could see what else we had done for me. Nah, I don't like the I don't like I don't like the idea of having um recent civs certainly not hitler certainly not 
in the sea. Any despots like that? OG Earth Goddess for my ability? Yeah, that'd be cool. Or like Goddess of the Harvest. Theater squares have good adjacency to all districts. That'd be cool. It, it might even be holy sites. I know you're joking. I know you're joking. I wasn't scolding you. Um, I was just weighing in. Um, might even be something with holy sites at this at this stage of my. Probably used to be theater squares, but OG was two faith from from uh, breathtaking tiles. Yep. Or or goddess of the harvest. That'd be pretty sweet. That'd be pretty sweet. Um, all right, let's call this a video. We're almost at the end of this era. Thank you so much for watching twitch.tv slash the game mechanic. Uh, and we're going to figure out what my other leader abilities were. So stop on by friends over at YouTube. We'll see you soon.